Hello and welcome back to Bits and Bobs. Today's video is the top 10 rarest shillings ever minted between 1817 and 1966, which is when the modern milled shilling was used in circulation. And by the way, these are only circulation coins, no proofs or NIFCs. So we'll start with number 10 and count down to the rarest. The 10th rarest is the 1863 one shilling coin, as we see now on screen. What I'll do for all these coins is show you the mintage and then the value. So the mintage of this coin is 859,320. So even the 10th place is less than 900,000 minted, meaning all these coins, as suggested, will be very rare and definitely ones that you'd want in your collection. The value is 50 pounds in the most worn and sort of really dirty condition and up to a thousand pounds in the best condition. Throughout the video, the top price at the top of the screen or the lower price will be for the most worn and cheapest example and the bottom price will be for an uncirculated or very, very nice condition one to get the worst and the best price range. Now then, ninth place. This one goes to the 1869, a very similar type of coin from a similar era with the same design, of course, by Jean-Baptiste Malen. This one, though, is even rarer with only 736,560 ever being minted back in 1869. This one commands less of a premium though, only £50 for the cheapest and most worn example, and £450 for a very nice or uncirculated variant. Now then, we move on to 8th place, and the 8th rarest shilling is the 1823, a different design from an older time period during the reign of George IV. This coin has a lovely design featuring the crown shield and garter. The mintage of the coin is even less once again, 693000 being made back in 1823 a value of once again £50 in a very worn condition and just over £1,000 for one that is uncirculated and really nice detail. Now then, getting rarer still, we move on to 7th place. The 7th rarest shilling is the 1850 shilling, once again going back to this design. This one has a mintage of 685,080, so again, rarer and rarer still. This one has a value of £500 in worn condition and £5,000 in uncirculated condition. This one is a bit of an outlier as there's not many around despite a fairly large mintage of still hundreds of thousands. Now then, we move on to the sixth rarest shilling and this is the 1849 shilling, one year prior to that last one, the 1850. This one is a bit rarer with a mintage of 645,000, which is quite low, relatively speaking, for the shillings in this period and this has a value of £20 in the most worn condition and £380 in the best condition. This one has a lot of its examples still surviving, and it's not just about the mintage, it's also about the how many survive, the popularity and stuff, and all different things like that to drive the price of a coin. Now then, we're halfway through, fifth place goes to this coin. Now you can't tell the date straight away, as it's a date on the obverse of this coin. Looking to the obverse, we see this is George IV shilling from 1827. The 1827 shilling had a mintage of 500 74,000, which is getting very low. A value of £25 to be extremely worn variants, and up to £700, one that's in tip-top condition or near uncirculated. Now then, we move on to number four. What is the fourth rarest shilling ever made? It is the 1854 shilling. Once again, the Jean-Baptiste Merlin design on the reverse. In 1854, there were 522,414 shillings minted, meaning it was a rare year of shillings and is now worth £225 in a very worn condition and £2,800 in the prime uncirculated example. So a very valuable coin. And now we move on to the medalists. In bronze or third position, the bronze medal goes to the 1905 one shilling, a more modern design and style than some of our other top 10 entries. This one has a mintage of only 488,390, now less than half a million, which is very rare in the world of coins. This one has a value of £80 in a worn circulated condition and up to £3,000 to get one in uncirculated quality. A very valuable coin. Now then, silver coins, silver medalist. The second place, the second rarest shilling is the 1837 shilling. Although it has the same design as some of the early Victorias, this is a coin from the reign of William IV with a mintage of only 479000 and a very rare coin at that. The value is £25 in extremely worn condition and £750 in uncirculated condition. So a bit of a less price, even though it is slightly rarer, and this is just depending on the coin market availability and popularity of the coins, as I've mentioned before. The mintage isn't the sole thing that drives the price, as we learn when we do these top 10 videos, because it's all about what people want, what is available, and obviously the demand of that coin overall. Now then, I won't keep waiting any longer. Number one, the rarest shilling ever made is the 1851 one shilling coin. Here we see an example on screen, a true beauty of a coin as the rarity makes it a renowned coin. 
This one has a mintage of only 470,071 ever made. This is very low, as over the years there were billions of these shillings minted. This one is worth £150 in a very, very worn example, and up to £2,000 in the most top quality uncirculated examples. So there we go. Comment down below what the rarest shilling is in your collection, and did it feature on this top 10 list? If so, then that's very good and very lucky for you. Now, while you're down there commenting, please also do subscribe to the channel, as all of our subscribers are really appreciated, and we hope you join us again for more videos as well. All that's left to do for this video though is to thank you very much for watching, we hope you've enjoyed it as well, and we'll see you next time on Bits and Bobs with some more cool videos about coins. Bye!